Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today's an exciting day. I'm becoming a plant mom. Yes, a plant mom, but I am a dog mom first. My dogs mean everything to me. So I had to do a lot of research to see what plants are safe to have around dogs, especially because the little guy loves to eat everything. I have to make sure my doggies are safe because I am a plant mom for, am I? I have to make sure my dogs are safe because I am a dog mom first and then I am a plant mom. Well, a new plant mom, I don't know much. So I'm gonna learn along the way. But the top three plants that I did wanna get, they're poisonous and toxic to dogs, of course. And I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna be familiar with these three plants. I'm sure you've seen them everywhere, social media. The workout I did this morning, she had two of the plants in her video. So they're everywhere, I love them can't have them. So the top three were the snake plant, beautiful plant. I think it's good for the air too. Don't quote me on it though. Beautiful plant, nice and simple, and they can get really big and I was excited for it, but no. Number two, the fiddle leaf fig tree. Wow. I wanted this one so bad. It's absolutely beautiful. And I did want a tree for the apartment. <laughs> well, looks like I gotta find another tree to put in here, but it's okay. And then the last one, sorry for my uh, pronunciation, the cut leaf philodendron, philodendron, whatever. Here you go. <laughs> um, I really wanted these three. Like, I didn't know the names of them, but I was like, I want those three. I, I want them. So I'm doing research, looking up the top plants, indoor plants, blah, blah, blah. And of course I found their names. And then I looked them up on the ASPCA website to see if they're okay for dogs. And they're not. So it's sad. But at the same time, I'm super excited because there's so many plants out there. And a lot of them are safe for dogs. But... The crazy thing is, if I didn't do this research, I would have these toxic plants around my dog. So I'm really glad I did some research, but plants are everywhere at my parents, at my in-laws, and you don't know until you do some research. So make sure if you are a dog mom to do some research about your plants. I'm sure you're wondering what plants are safe for dogs, but you're gonna have to stick around to find out which ones you can have at home for your pets. Let's get us some plants. We're here. Mask on. Let's go inside. I am sweating in here. It is so hot. I can't handle it. Did you know that celery grows like this? Can't believe it. I think we're finally in the plant section, yay! We're home. 
Let's get you guys situated. Welcome home, little munchkins. What is this thing? Okay. Anyways, look how cute you guys are. This is what I ended up buying. A little spider plant. A little banana. And these are the polka dot. And thank goodness this name is written down. Jacob's Ladder. So pretty. I'm really excited about this one. This actually wasn't on my list of what I wanted, but I saw it. I looked it up quickly, did some research, and it's amazing. It's so pretty. And I think it grows blue flowers. So this will be super fun. I actually have the polka dot one in, they come like reddish and darker green. So I have a little white collection now. It's funny because I actually wanted a lot more plants. I think I had like 15 plants on my list. Um, but thank goodness I didn't buy so much because I'm a new plant mom and i don't know much about plants i know i have a few but i just wear them they're very easy maintenance i guess because none of them are dying but i figured i gotta look up how to take care of these guys and make sure they stay alive these are just some of the plants that are safe for dogs there are so many out there but these are the ones i personally liked well i hope you guys enjoyed this video it's probably gonna be more plant videos, but at the moment I'm gonna learn how to take care of these four and make sure I know how to take care of them before I start buying more. And as I said before, I'm a dog mom first, so the puppies are most important and if I can handle four plants and two dogs, well then we can get more plants. But at the moment, the two dogs and four plants are a handful. I'll see you later guys, bye.